Hi guys, this is Mike from Website Builders Critic. Today I'm going to show you how to make a business website using Weebly in five minutes or less. When you first log into Weebly, you'll be presented with a dashboard that looks similar to the one you see in front of you now. To get started, click on the Edit button. Once you've done that, you'll be presented with three choices, either create a store, a blog, or a site. In the case of a business website, we're going to pick Site. You Now you can see a list of themes in front of you. In the top drop down for all styles, select Corporate. That'll give you a list of all available business themes that Weebly has. Find the one that suits best what you're looking to achieve and click on the Choose button. You're now going to be asked whether you own a domain, want to register a new one, or you want to use a subdomain of Weebly. In the case of this demo, we're going to just do a subdomain of Weebly. So I'll put in my corporate website.weebly.com and click continue. I'm now in the editor. The first thing you're going to want to do is make changes to your logo. You have two choices. You can upload a logo by clicking on the logo button, or you can just alter the text by simply clicking and changing it. If you want to make any changes to the image in the slider, the, or pardon me, the large image on the website, just click on Edit Image, and you can now add a new one. Now Weebly presents you with a number of choices. You can either purchase photos from them to use, upload your own, or select from some free ones that they have available. For now, I'm just going to pick a standard free one picture of a plane. I'll select the crop and save. You can see that the former, former image has now been replaced with a picture of a plane. To make changes to any of the text throughout this, you just simply highlight it. and replace it. If you need to make changes to button text, simply click on it, make your changes here, alter your link. So in other words, you're going to select where it's going to go to and highlight the text to change it. Now this drag elements here section is presented for you. What you can do basically is just bring in a title and some text or whatever image elements you want to bring in and start working on it right away. Again, anything you want to change, simply click and make your changes. It's that simple. If you need to make changes to individual pages, you can click on the Pages menu at the top, select the page you want to change, choose the information, so whether you want a tall header, short header, no header, or a landing page style. Once you've done that, you click Save and Edit, and it'll load that specific page for you to make changes to. You can then remove the pictures, or drag and drop whatever elements you want in. For instance, you want to throw in a map. There we go. If you want to bring in a contact form. You can see it's extremely simple to make changes by just dragging in the various elements that you want to do. Look how fast you can build an about or a contact page. You want to make design changes, simply click on the design menu. You can change your theme, your fonts, and each individual area's font. You can add a search box to the website, in which case you will be prompted to upgrade. You can see here it's prompting me to upgrade to Weebly Pro, which for $6.63 a month isn't a particularly bad deal and something you may want to consider doing. That'll give you a site search option, which you can add to your website. And really, to get a corporate website for $6 is pretty inexpensive. And 
in the short, that is basically how to create a website for a small business using Weebly. Stay tuned to future videos where I'll show you how to modify your search engine optimization settings with Weebly, add an online store, and more. If you enjoyed this video, please feel free to subscribe below or click on the share icons to help spread the word. Thank you.